how are you today? Today is our the third part of our uh, class in our science. But before that, I want to greet you a good day to everyone. So, now, are you ready? Good. Let's start. Now, our subject will be science. Now, our topic in science, it's all about how living things move. Okay, I will ask you later about this one. How living things move. <clears throat> Let's read first our three vocabulary words. First word is human. Human. Spell the word human. H U M A N. Human. Very good. Let's proceed to number two. Number two is place. Place. Let's spell the word place. P L A C E. Place. Good. Now, next word is flower. Flower. Let's spell the word flower. F L O W E R. Flower. Very good. Our topic again it's all about how living things move. <clears throat> now, most of the living things can move on their own, right? Okay, I have here an example. The first example is a dog can move on its own, right? Yes, they can move like this. Okay, look at the dog, so cute, right? a little bit fat and the second one is oh what a cute dog yes look at the dog the dog is moving on its own right and the other one is this one okay that is how dog move on its own now a dog move on its own by running or run look at this video uh, video clip That dog ran very good. When the dog lost his balance, that's why he he dropped it and he rolled it. Okay, that is how dog moves its own. Next, the other one. A dog can move on its own by what? By walking or walk. Look at this. This dog walking each other see how cute they can walk on its own by walking or they can move on its own by walking right good job see how cute are they now let's proceed to next a dog can move on its own by jump or jumping. Look at this. Oh, this dog is so happy. He's jumping, jumping, and jumping. Okay, so that is how dog move on its own. The next one. How do animals move? Again, one more time. How do animals move? I have here a video clip about how do animals move. Okay, let's watch and enjoy. First one is cheetah. It's a cheetah. See? Cheetah is the fastest animal in the world. They can run very fast. Okay. Second is an elephant. They move by walking or they walk.
Second one is rabbit. And the third, a rabbit hop. Look at them. They are playing, they're hopping, right? They're so cute. Next is the fish. A fish moved by swimming. They swim. And next is a bird. How bird move? They move by flying or fly. They fly so high. Next is the snake. Yes, they slither. And how about the turtle? How they move? The turtle, they crawl. Right. Okay. These animals move run, and these animals can move walk, and this help. The one is swim, and this one is they fly. Snakes are slither, and the scorpion, alligator, and the gecko they crawl. So that's all about how animals or how living things move. How do animals move? Okay. Now let's proceed to another slide. Okay, the next one is how living things move. Another example here, a human can move on its own. You know what is human? When we say human, that is us, people, yes. Okay, even they are girl or a boy, they call it human, right? Okay, so how they move on its own? So, human move on its own by running or run, walk, jump, and climb. Okay, first we will proceed to this picture or this, uh, look at this clip. Okay, two humans they are jumping right okay another one here look at this okay how they move they are jumping or they jump that is human move on its own the next one look at this he ran very fast right that is how human move on its own another here is oh so what is this it's Run, very good. Now let's proceed to the next one. How about this? Look at all these people. What they do? They move by what? By walking or they walk, right? Very good. So that how human move on its own. Next, how about this one? Look at the first slide. This Three, uh, this boy want to climb up, but sad to say that branch of a tree is not too strong and then he fall down, right? Okay. Now another one here is the, this man is climbing uh, on the rock. Okay, that is rock climbing. Okay, so they uh, climb. Okay, so now here. The next one is the next one here is living things can move from one place to another isn't it correct yes they can move from one place to another but not all living things right living things can move their parts too okay. just like an example is a plant is a living thing right yes so they cannot walk right they cannot run but they can move 
their body parts or their parts. And for example, plants cannot move from one place to another, right? But some plants can move their parts. Okay, now they can move their, their parts by how? What's this clip about how plants move their parts? This is a time lapse about a sandflower from day one to day 83. On day one, day two, day three, the seeds started to grow. Day seven, they are big already, have four leaves. And day 12, they started to move and grow fast. That plant is a sand flower. Day 30, they started to grow another leaf. And they grow taller and taller. Day 53, the flowers started to, to grow also. Mm nice that is how plants move their parts in day 65 the flowers started to develop day 70 the flowers started to bloom wow you know what is that flower okay it's a sand flower so pretty and so cute and so beautiful and then after they bloom they will die also even they dying their body parts move also right so that's all how plants move their part so now let's proceed to next Okay, now, I will ask you, did you understand our topic about how living things move? Okay, now, if you understand, let's have our short activity. This is only three items. This is what you are going to do. For our activity, answer the following by writing, yes, they can. And no, they cannot. I have here an example. Number one, can dogs move from one place to another? One more time, can dogs move from one place to another? What do you think will be the answer? The correct answer is, yes, they can. So, can you please prepare your notebook and pencil and write numbers one to three for our short activity now are you ready okay let's start for number one answer the following by writing yes they can and no they cannot number one can some living things move their parts again can some living things move their parts will be the answer yes they can or no they cannot number two can non-living things move their own from one place to another again can non-living things move their own from one place to another yes they can or no they cannot number three can some living thing move from one place to another? 
Okay, this now is we will talk about living things. Can some living things move from one place to another? What will be the answer? Yes, they can or no, they cannot. As I always say, let's stop COVID-19 by staying at home and stay safe. Always take care and have a good day to everyone and bye-bye.